I'm Matthew Goodwin from the University of Kent and a senior fellow at Chatham House. Uh, so tonight I'm talking about Brexit and the factors that uh, led to the vote to leave the European Union and also the consequences of that uh, vote in particular for British politics and society. Uh, so I'm looking at things like what, what types of groups uh, ended up voting uh, for Brexit, uh, why they uh, did so and bringing together a lot of research that the social sciences have built up over the last uh, 16 months looking at different aspects of, of that referendum uh, decision and then reflecting on kind of where that leaves us now as a, as a political system, as a, as a society and, and where we might be headed next. Well, I'm uh, very lucky to be able to present uh, uh, some of our research to this audience. Um, I also think sharing research across disciplinary boundaries is absolutely uh, essential. Uh, and also, you know, much of what we're discussing is, is underpinned by a lot of things that geographers, particularly political geographers, would be uh, very interested in, the splits between the city uh, and, and rural communities, uh, the splits between Lon uh, London, for example, the university towns in Scotland and, and, and non-urban areas. Um, a lot of these debates in Europe at the moment about the revival of populism are underpinned by debates around um, political geography and how voters in different types of areas um, act in different ways at elections despite looking otherwise very similar. Uh, so I think hopefully there are lots of points of convergence, lots of points of interest that the uh, that the audience might uh, warm to, um, and hopefully I can learn something as well.